Hey everybody, this is John from MyBookBuilder.com and today I'm going to go over a quick tutorial on how to load the HTML file that we're sending you into Constant Contact so you can already have a ready-made e-blast all ready to go. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is go to ConstantContact.com as you can see I've already done that and from the home page you're going to want to select Campaigns Then over on the right hand side, you're going to want to hit create. And when this menu pops up here, you're not actually going to select one of these options. You're going to go down to choose a campaign by category, followed by newsletters and announcements. And then all the way at the bottom right here is custom code email. And then go ahead and hit create. So if you've used Constant Contact before, this is going to be very familiar to you, especially this early. Um, we'll just put test1 in there right now for an email name. Go ahead and hit next. You're going to keep this at HTML, so you don't need to change anything on the screen. Just go ahead and hit next again. Um, but what we're going to do, the thing that makes this different than the normal use of Constant Contact, is you're going to want to go over to here where it says Advanced Editor. Now Advanced Editor is going to bring up the HTML for this email. And we're actually going to do this instead of going through all the normal steps that you would see where we'd be saying um, you know, the, the to line and from line and header and footer and things like that. So what you're going to want to do is open up your notepad. It's going to look something like this. Select anywhere in there and then hit Control A, which is a shortcut for select all. Control C, which is a shortcut to copy everything that you've just selected. We'll get rid of this. We'll highlight everything in here because we're going to be replacing it. And then we'll hit Control V. And it's as simple as that. So now that we've added all that in there, I'm going to hit Save and Return. And then to see what this is gonna look like, we'll just hit preview and test. And as you can see, a little window pops up right here, letting you preview the email, see what it's gonna look like. And just from that line of code, we were able to already add in all this custom content. Now this content will obviously be customized to the email that you're sending, um, and we will create it for you uh, just for your email blast. So yours will look a little bit different. But even in this preview, you're able to click through, check the links, things like that. So you can really get a uh, good understanding of what it's going to look like. So uh, after you're done checking this, you can go ahead and close this out. And then everything else is going to be the exact same as it would be for a regular e-blast you're sending out. Um, you could just go to next. You're able to skip all this. And then for message footer, you're just going to enter in your custom uh, information right here. And other than that, everything else is the same. After you'd entered that in, you'd hit Save and Next, and then it's uh, smooth sailing as far as your regular constant contact email blast. So again, this has been John Fitzgerald from MyBookBuilder.com, and I hope this has been useful. Thanks.